Hello everyone and welcome to a new video on my YouTube channel. So this is the first video of a new series called Golf 101. new series is all about golf for beginners. As it names Golf 101, I'll try to keep it as simple as possible by explaining uh, as much as possible. Kind of complicated, but I will try to do my best. We're gonna talk about uh, topics like golf course, golf rules, golf equipment, golf swings, golf strategies and uh, everything which is related uh, on golf and of course everything which is related with me and uh, my path to uh, maybe one day scratch. So in the topic of today we're gonna talk about golf course. First of all we know that the golf course has 18 holes. That's a regular golf course for a championship or whatever the one that you see on TV where the PGA Tour play, the European Tour and whatever it's always an 18 holes course. Uh, golf courses are divided in three main categories. We have the part three, which is the shortest holes. We have the part four, and we have the part five, which are the longer ones. So actually, for giving you an idea, I'm gonna just post a little bit here, of, uh, here on the side, the picture or, uh, of the hole where we are now. We are actually at hole number two in uh, Jumlinza, my home golf course. and. Uh, uh, as they are working on the greens, we have the golf course for, for us today, so just uh, to enjoy this video uh, day. Let's dive a little bit deeper into uh, the tee boxes argument. The tee boxes, as you saw in the flyover with the drone, are divided in four different points, and you have four different points exactly for four categories of players. We have men, the white one, for from zero to uh, twelve point four handicap. Over twelve point five handicap, we have to play from the yellow tee boxes. And the same works for the uh, woman, uh, respectively the uh, blue one for the low handicap and the red for the high handicap. Now imagine we tee off our ball here and we hit a good driver in the middle of the ferry. Let's go to the ball. If you hit a good ball and you hit a very good straight shot, you're gonna land on this wonderful part of the uh, golf course, which is the fairway. It's a very short grass where you can hit easy uh, under the ball, so you can add spin, you can add height, and you can hit properly. Now, if you hit it a little bit to the right, okay, you may land here from the red post in is considered as a hazard. What does that mean? Actually, that means that if you find your ball, you can play it as it lies, or you can take a drop with a penalty shot. And actually, if the ball enters before the hazard, you have to go before the hazard, actually, the nearest point uh, where the ball entered the hazard. But that we're gonna see it in another video, more in detail with the rules. If, in the other hand, you hit it a little bit to the left and uh, you miss the fairway, you can find yourself in the fairway bunker. 
Fairway Blanque is actually sand, uh, which is in a, in a shape given by the designer of the golf course. And if it's in the fairway, it's called Fairway Bunker, magic. And if it's near to the green or on the side of the green, it's a, a green side bunker. Actually, it's the same sand, it's the same bunker, it's the same stuff. It's just different shots that you're gonna perform, but that we're gonna see it when we talk about bunker shots. Of course, being on the bunker, it's not a penalty, so we'll not get the penalty, we'll not get an extra shot or whatever. Exiting the bunker, it's already complicated enough. So that's actually your uh, problem with uh, hitting a bunker. So this is the area of the fairway where you are supposed to hit your second shot uh, after your uh, tee shot. And uh, if you are in a good position, you have a third shot into the green. So that means that you are playing green in regulation. That means you still have two putts before uh, getting to par. And uh, if you go a little bit to the left, we're gonna see you have again a water hazard. And if you go a little bit to the right, you have again bunkers that are protecting uh, the green. This is again a water hazard because it has the red posters. Then we have here in the middle where now the irrigation is on, we have the green. And then here we have a, f a, little, a little bunker, which is next to the green, but still not the, a green side uh, bunker. But just over there, we have another bunker that is exactly one meter uh, right of the, of the green. And that's uh, definitely a green side. But then we have another part of the golf, which actually isn't a part of the golf course, is everything which is behind it, this uh, uh, little trees here and the fence is actually OB. OB means out of bounds. And if you hit your ball there, you're gonna hit outside of the golf course. That means that you have to replay your ball from the position where you hit the shot with a penalty uh, shot. That means, for instance, if you play your first ball from the tee shot and you hit it straight away out of bounds, you're gonna hit from the tee again, but this time it's no more your first shot, it's your third shot. So you're gonna start with three. And if you need to play par by the end of the golf course or the golf hole, uh, yeah, that gets a little bit more tricky. So here we are again, back on the tea boxes. I just want to say thank you for watching this video. And if you like the content, please leave a thumb up and consider uh, subscribing to this YouTube channel. And of course, following me on Instagram on the page Tina Golf. Everything is linked here uh, down the video. Thank you very much. See you for episode two.